Now we'll get our viewers just for the lot to show you some of Granny's radioactive chooks and fiesta wear that I've come across. And uh, over here, got some typical fiesta wear that can be found in second hand shops and things. Nice little glass chook here, little salt dish. Glows beautifully under an ultraviolet light. That's due to uranium dioxide. It was used as a colouring agent for the glass. Another chook here. Has like a frosted appearance. Also looks lovely. Beautiful glass dish here. Let's see. And also some radio valves used uranium glass to seal the electrodes. That's just due to the uranium glass has the same thermal expansion characteristics as the metal. Maintains the glass seal without cracking as the tube heats up. Yeah, got a few different Cold War style Geiger counters. This is a Model 68 Radiac set. Complete with a headset. External probe, smaller probes for the higher range settings and the alpha window that you can open Lullum instrument and a civil defence unit, a CDV 700. Also with a little headset here. Alright, okay, let's try this unit here. We'll just check this uranium glass for activity. Pretty low dose, so basically uranium glass is perfectly safe for collecting and stuff. On the other hand, the Fiesta Wear, have a look at that. This dates from uh, 1936. That's when uranium was used in the glaze to give it a nice orange colour. You can tell the early stuff by the uh, logos underneath. This little plate here has had a fair bit of use in its life. See by the glaze it's worn down. 1945, American government confiscated the uranium glaze stockpile and used it in the weapons program. And I think they used depleted uranium after that. Not 100% sure, but plenty of information out in the net to have a look at. Here's another piece here. So that's all the early stuff. Right, uh, let's see what we get off this lot. So just on the low range setting here, and already holding the probe back, and it's going off a scale already. So we'll just change the scale setting.
it's all good stuff so you never know what you'll find in granny's old kitchen if you ever have to clean her stuff out one day worth looking at stuff carefully and it's all uh, good stuff to hang on to well anyway thanks for watching everyone and stay tuned I'll see what else I can uh, put a video onto